Hello, it's Dr. Sarah Walton here, and I'm in northern Thailand near the Miramar or Burmese border at the highest point in northern Thailand. You can see behind me, it's very beautiful. We're very high up, 1,500 meters above sea level. And there's a sense of peace, quiet and gratitude. Don't know if you can hear the birds in the trees. I'm here with a friend of mine, Newman, who is a nature therapist. And we've been communing with nature. Mountains are important. They give us a summit to aim for. And some people compare the process of writing a book with climbing a mountain. Any project can be seen that way. My mentor, Dr. Martin Goodman, wrote a wonderful book called On Sacred Mountains. And in that book, he wrote that the thing with mountains is that once you reach one, reach one summit, the next one is displayed before you. But first you have to reach that summit. And for a lot of people, knowing what mountain to climb is a very challenging thing. Many people come to me in my life coaching work and soul writing work and say, I don't know what my passion is. To sort of find your soul purpose is something very important, but you're not gonna find it outside of you. You need to go inside and find it. So we're gonna do a short meditation exercise so that you can find your own sacred mountain, your passion, your soul purpose. So what you need is a paper and pen a cushion, something with somewhere quiet to sit, or if you happen to live near a mountain, please go out and climb to the summit and sit and do this on that mountain. Ask the mountain to guide you. But otherwise you can just do it at home. Make sure you won't be disturbed. And we're gonna take a trip inside ourselves into the infinite space of our inner worlds. We are all creative. You are infinitely creative whether you know it or not so off we go breathing in we always go in through the same door the breath closing our eyes now and i'm going to meet you at the bottom of a mountain and i'm sitting cross-legged mountain just like this a forest mountain, a jungle mountain. There's a lot of greenery. Just imagine that and you're sitting comfortably on a cushion at the bottom of this mountain. And I'm sitting next to you in silence. And we breathe, close our eyes. And I invite you to focus on the light at the center of your chest, your heart, center. Breathing in all the way through the heart center down into our diaphragm and making the out breath, the exhalation slightly long, long, longer than the inhalation. And that will make the next inhalation slightly longer. So slowing the breath down Breathing in and breathing out. And every inhalation, that light at the center of your chest gets brighter and brighter, lighting up your inner world. And you can feel the jungle rising up the mountain behind you. There is a deep presence in the forest of the mountain, a deep vibration, all of the plants and animals and insects coming together to create 
a symphony of Om. Om. Breathing in, listening to the sounds in your imagination, the birds, the humming, the twittering, Breathing in, and then on the out breath, Om. In again, and one last, Om. And on the next inhalation, Breathe yourself as part of that jungle mountain. You are part of it now. You are pulsating at the same vibration as the mountain. Now I invite you to imagine yourself walking through the door which opens behind you in the mountain. The door is enormous and it is glittering green. And it is covered in beautiful flowers. And this is your door, your private door into your private mountain. And at the top of this mountain is a place where you can sit to find your sole purpose. So breathing in, you walk through the door into the mountain and there is a spiral staircase going up the mountain. It is glittering green also. And I gesture for you to walk up this staircase step by step, breathing in 10, steps as you go count them internally to yourself keep breathing and keep focusing on your heart center one two continue on your own to ten Keep focusing on your heart center and as you breathe, I'm going to say a few words. I am free. I am infinite possibility. I'm grace. I am whole. I am infinite creativity. Keep walking up the spiral staircase and breathing as you go. And when you reach the top, you will see a beautiful golden light at the top of the staircase. You follow the light out and you find yourself on the summit of a mountain. And above you is a beautiful peaceful golden light, the sun streaming down, but it's cool up here and there's a very calm breeze. Now I would like you to imagine that light at the center of your being. Jump into the shoulder of your writing arm as you stand here and take in the view at the summit of the mountain under the golden light that is streaming through the crown of your head, connecting with your heart center, allowing that golden light to pulsate in the palm of your writing hand. Now pick up your pen and continue this sentence. My soul purpose is, my soul purpose is just write the words that come 
Don't analyze, don't worry about grammar or full stops, just write. If you see images, write them down. If you feel emotions, translate those emotions into words. Any words, the first words that come are the most powerful and full of truth. Keep writing. Go back inside, gather up that light. Breathe the words onto the page. If you would like to share these words with me, my sole purpose is keep writing, keep being the golden light. Then I would love to hear what your sole purpose is. For more writing tips, please go to soulwriting.co, soulwriting.co. It's Dr. Sarah Walton here. It's been a pleasure to meditate with you. Please go off and enjoy your soul purpose. Manifest it, make it happen. If you'd like some help and assistance with that journey, I'd love to help you. Thank you.